What's going on guys, San here and in this video I'm pretty excited to tell you guys after much playing around with the game settings of Black Ops 3, monitoring my GPU and CPU performance and consumption, I think I finally figured out what's causing the frame rate drops in Black Ops 3. Before I get into what's causing the issue, let me explain something so you get a better idea as to why it's happening in the first place. Okay, so the story begins when a GPU renders a video game. It grabs all the textures and necessary files from your hard drive, this often happens during the loading screen. All this information is stored onto your GPU's onboard video buffer, in other words your video card memory. Since this is the fastest memory the core of your GPU can access to render your beautiful little games. Now if the texture quality is so high that it cannot all at once be loaded onto your video buffer, then your GPU is going to get stressed out with all the constant fetching and reloading the textures into your video card memory. And to load new textures when the video buffer is already full, it has to delete the least necessary chunk. And when the least necessary chunk of textures are needed again, it is reloaded and the whole process recycles. Now we know the loading and reloading textures from the hard drive is pretty slow since it has to go through your PCI Express port, through the connections on your motherboard through the serial ATA connectors and into your hard drive, this is a pretty long journey for memory to constantly be jumping around when all the textures can fit nice and snug in your GPU's video buffer. And to avoid stressing your GPU and reload textures all the time, bump down your texture quality. After a lot of time on Black Ops 3 tinkering with their settings and monitoring my GPU memory consumption, I've realized when on low settings, Black Ops 3 consumes just under 2GB capacity of my GPU. When I bump it up, it exceeds its capacity and continues its journey to load and reload and don't get me started when I get onto Ultra. So guys, all in all, Black Ops 3 is a terrible port <coughs> and game textures aren't optimized for a lot of GPUs in your average gamer's build but if you have a video card with 2 gigahertz video buffer just like me, play on low texture quality since this setting directly addresses the video card memory on your GPU. Tinker with the rest of the settings as you wish since most of the rest are dependent on your GPU's core clock. Hope this video has made Black Ops 3 somewhat playable for you guys. Leave a comment below and tell me if it's helped you and I'll try my best to respond to any questions. Remember to subscribe and share the video with all your friends who can't play Black Ops 3 on their PCs and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.